Good morning, everyone. I hope everyone's having a great day, evening, morning. As you can hear by my voice, yeah, the flu got to us. And I know exactly why. It's because of this whole... I don't know if anyone else also has a bit like... You know when you walk and like you're breathing in cold air like constantly, you know? And then like it starts to like irritate your throat and then like you end up having flu. If anyone gets that, I know I have a friend that does. So like when it was yesterday morning, I was walking and like my nose was stinging here because it was just that cold. And then this whole weather thing of like in the morning, it's puss cold in the afternoon it's puss hot okay summer like can we decide on what the weather is and then come on there's wind as well and then also at night very cold now i'm sick and i'm not happy about it i don't like being sick i don't think anyone likes being sick i think i'd prefer being sick if maybe it was like school holidays and I have nothing to do, but now I'm sick and I have to do so much, so. But anyway, new, what do I say? New week, new me. I know it's Thursday, but I don't know. I just wanted to add a saying because I changed my bedding. Yeah, I, I made it white now. It looks really nice. I've made my avo toast. Wait, let me be real. I don't really have a toaster, so my avo on bread no but actually i do have a toaster nap but it's like you know you see the triangle toaster sorry i'm trying to put pep on if you see the camera shaking you see the triangle bread where like you you make like cheese toast usually yeah, i have that one i wasn't feeling like cheese toast today and then i'm gonna have some ginger tea to drink because i feel sick so also check i have so much tea and I bought this one recently. I want to try hibiscus. Um, I hear that it's really good, so. Grating some cheese. You know this grater, actually? How cool is this grater? Now I'm just showing you guys everything in my house. Um, but check, it's like one of those where, like, you can put the cheese somewhere. But the problem is that, sorry about this. Guys, I forgot my tripod stand at home. And I'm not very happy about it, but... Retiring. What was I saying? Today's gonna be uh, quite a busy day, actually. I'm still gonna write down what I need to do. Today, um, at about 10.30 ish, I'm meeting up with a friend to go to the EBIT Korea fair for like a little bit. And then after that, I'm gonna go to a practical session for the cheese. I'm gonna go to this practical session for C++ and then after that I have a practical session for my art or VIO and then that one is like practical sessions for art are basically like when the teacher like reviews our work for the week and uh, we're, we're like in small groups and then like we discuss like what my idea for the week was whatever and like ways I can improve it. And then after that, I have a COS 110 lecture or C++ lecture. And then I have an operating systems tutorial session. Quite a busy day. On top of that, I have a practical due tomorrow for C++. So I need to finish that. And I have an assignment due on Monday. So that's just great. But yeah, that's a tea there. I wonder if you guys were able to see anything, but here's my avo. And we're gonna watch some Lisa. It's about eight in the morning now. I'm gonna try to finish my practical my C++ uh, programming practical because I need to get it out of the way so
forget. Um, yeah, so check. I decided to tie my hair up because this shirt, let me show you the back. The back of the shirt, it looks like this. How cool. So then I thought I'd style it with the hoodie inside because it's still like a little bit cold outside. So. The aula. Yeah. Aula. I think so. Like the. Oh yeah. There's also there's a lot of like like bags and stuff. So I guess that's like one part of our career that's like there's always an option there. But people also like to work at like water and stuff. How cute is that? Is this like within the aula? Are we like? Right, it's it's giving the, the digital arts entry requirements. So we got a cupcake, how cute, and tablets. Are you okay with being shot? Okay. <laughs> how nice! This is cement planter, by the way. Yeah. This muffin, I mean this cupcake, deserves a 10 out of 10. Or the cream deserves a 10 out of 10. It's like that. You know when people make that buttery kind of cream? Yeah, it's that kind. Going to the IT lab. So, let's go. IT labs on this side and downstairs. And then the EBIT study center is here. It's pretty nice. It's so much. So my code is not working at all. I tried making a make file, doesn't work. They think it's a Mac OS problem as opposed to like the actual code. So they suggested that I go ask um, some of the tutors in the other lab. So I'm gonna go there. Great. Um, we're on a good note. I'm almost there. The output prints out the way I need it to but I'm not testing for like every single condition correctly, so I need to alter that. But now I have an art practical session that I need to go to, so. Right, so it turns out my session is online. I didn't read my emails, so yeah, we're having it online now. Campus, nice. Wait, I just finished my prac session and now I'm going to a lecture, I'm going to my pause 110 lecture i'm in the dining hall so i just got some water and a muffin because i am i just i feel so sick and um i'm gonna try finish my code here well not really finish maybe like just you know, try sort out this problem. Can you imagine this cafeteria is currently playing Brent? They are currently playing Price of Fame by Brent Fires. That is crazy. I really like it. But anyway, this is the back or the outside. I actually came outside because I was looking for my friends. They said they were here, but they actually met the actual cafeteria, not the dining hall and now I'm gonna go to them and I want to say hi because I haven't seen them in so long so yeah so yeah oh my god so I came to the cafeteria um to see my friends say hi hi <laughs> so cute but I'm gonna leave in like a few minutes to go to my tutorial okay so update last lecture of the day we're going back to centenary centenary people call it centenary i say centenary and it's gonna be a tutorial for operating systems or for cars 122 it's been such a long day oh my days oh i forgot to explain centenary is a building
no ways that was like the longest school day of my life like uh -uh. but shame today was nice in the fact that i saw so many people that i knew or like friends from school or you know just people i know in general it was very nice but it was too long and i feel sick so i literally just want to stay in bed the whole day but obviously i can't do that it's almost six now and only now i'm back in my room so yeah being a uni student huh and time some people i can't believe like some people actually have like lectures at like 7 30 and then all the way until like five or something and i'm like and i feel tired now nah, but today was a very busy day and yet i still have no time to rest i still need to figure out my freaking era in my prac and you know do the assignment that's due next monday um the assignment is a c plus plus assignment i don't know if i said already but it is, and it's like, it's huge. That's all I can say. I don't know, do I stop filming here? Do you guys wanna see what I'm gonna have for dinner? I'm just, you know, I'm gonna have dinner. Like, okay, I'm gonna try debug my code for a little bit, and then I'm gonna have dinner, and then continue fighting programming, basically. So yeah, that's my day. I don't know, do you guys wanna see it? Might as well. Hello, Mayo. I literally, I completely forgot to show you guys what I'm having. So it's basically this chicken burrito thingy from Woolies. So yeah. Then I'm having more ginger tea because, yeah, I, yeah. And I'm watching some Bojack Horseman. So that's the tea there. I have been dealing with the same memory leakage for the past 12 hours okay not 12 hours the memory leakage only came about like maybe at 12 p.m so it's been about eight hours obviously not consecutive hours because you, you guys were with me i had lectures in between but and my job is i just it's uh, frustrating me because it's like i know i can like you know like get through it and stuff but it's just taking forever to get to that point and it's frustrating me for that like because i know that this is probably going to be the easiest practical that they're giving us this semester i know that it is so i don't want to like skip it and then be like ah i'll just make sure i do well in the next one yeah with the course 110 that never works out <laughs> unless it's like i don't know you're a genius or like unless it's like you're not a beginner in this stuff yeah let me put it that way can you guys guess what time it is it's midnight can you guess what i'm doing the prac that i was busy with the whole day i'm so tired and time i'm still worried about the assignment that's due monday that i need to do and i'm busy being worried about this prac i mean essentially no man the assignment's literally five percent just lost the prac and focus on the assignment the problem is that this is c plus plus are we sure that five percent is gonna like come to you like are we sure so now missing out on two percent that you probably will get as opposed to missing out on the five percent after you've tried and tried or whatever because the assignments are i don't know if that makes sense it's midnight i'm very tired i've had a long day but the assignments are like way bigger way more difficult than like the pracs and especially this prac it's like way more challenging than this prac so now i'm gonna end the video here i guess yeah it's not it's not on the best note but you know what? It, it happens. I'll probably get it like tomorrow and ask for help and stuff. So I'm not too stressed. Yeah. I hope you guys have an amazing evening or morning or afternoon whenever you decide to watch this. That's a good night and a peace out for me. Okay, wait. Um, quick update. So was able to submit that prep. <sighs> got my full marks.
Bad news, I was not able to submit the assignment. It's okay. It's okay. Because I started it very late and then the weekend came and then I was like, I need to do and finish all my art that's due well this week now um so that i would be able to just focus on c plus plus because i had a semester test this week from that last clip let me say i had it the following week i mean i had it today so might as well give an update about that as well um in long story short it was not it was not hard but it was not easy so it was like the right amount of difficulty for cause 110 in my opinion so i'm really happy about that because if, if you knew the 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 test we had last year you 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 so i'm really happy about that i hope you guys have a great day further again and peace out